I'm going to talk to you today about two different swing patterns. The first swing pattern is when the arms are swinging in front of the body with out as much body turn and the other one is when the arms swing on a flatter plane with more body rotation. Now occasionally I'll get a player that um, has a very difficult time turning through the golf ball and the swing pattern that is more ideal for them is to have the arms to swing more in front of their body and their body almost following the arms a little bit as they're going through the golf ball. The one thing that, that happens when that occurs is the arms are swinging on a more upright swing plane and when you swing on a more upright swing plane, particularly on the follow through, the face is going to have a tendency to stay more open than when you swing flatter on the follow through. So in that type of a golf swing, you're going to see more face rotation both on the back swing and the finish and you're going to get your speed from swinging your arms faster. This is what it looks like if you get the arms to stay in front of your body. Okay, So it requires somewhat more timing because you're trying to time the rotation of the club so that you can square up the club face. Now the advantage of that is, is that if you do have a hard time turning your body you can still create a lot of speed without that uncomfortable feeling of, of having to turn your body through the shot. The other one is what you see more on tour and that is, is the, the, the club is swung comfortably over the right shoulder instead of up here and because the club is being swung over the left shoulder on the follow through the club face is being squared up by the plane of the golf swing instead of the rotation of the arm. So this is more of what is a pivot driven swing. The first swing where the arms are in front of your body is more of an arm driven swing. This is what the pivot driven swing looks like. And you'll notice a freer pivot through the golf ball and one of the ways that you can really enhance this feeling is to try to feel as though you control the length of the shot by how fast you pivot through the golf ball. Either one of these swing patterns is correct, but it's important to identify which pattern you prefer so you know the uh, strengths and the weaknesses of both.